Hello, everyone, and welcome to Rock Studios. I'm Stan Miller. I'm the PR and Analyst Relations Manager for Rockwell Automation in the EMEA region. I'm joined by Lori McDonald. She is the Global Head of the Rockwell Automation Partnership at PTC. Lori, welcome. Hello. Nice to see you. And I'm also joined by Adam Page. He is our PTC, PTC Strategic Partner uh, Manager at Rockwell. Adam, welcome. Hi. Thanks. Guys, we're here to talk about the Rockwell Automation PTC partnership and how that's dr driving digital transformation and bringing the connected enterprise to life. So, Laurie, if I may, sure. first question to you. Uh, Rockwell and PTC have built a partnership over the last few years, uh, particularly around industrial IoT and augmented reality solutions. How has that partnership and focus evolved over the last few years? Well, it's a great question. It's actually a really exciting partnership, and it started about four years ago, and we've seen it sort of pick up steam as the focus has really been on, you know, digital transformation. And when you take two companies, iconic companies like Rockwell and all their expertise and their, you know, name recognition in the factory, and you take PTC from a software perspective, and our focus on, you know, the IoT or ThingWorks platform, a along with augmented reality or our Vuforia solutions, and you put those together and the benefits that we can drive together for our customers and value and the scalability of it really makes the partnership exciting and continues to evolve you know, every single day. Would you agree? Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> so Adam, anything you'd like to add from a Rockwell automation perspective on that? I mean, you see, you know, through this journey and evolution, um, anything else you'd like to add? Well, I think uh, as we look at the portfolio that Rockwell's bringing to market for the connected enterprise, PTC fits a perfect you know, spot within that. And we do not necessarily look at IoT as something that we have. We focus on MES, our data and analytics, really everything around that portfolio. PTC um, at the enterprise level is really the best in class with Kepware and ThingWorks driving value to the market. Um, especially in augmented reality, as Lori said, for, for Vuforia, um, nothing like it on the market. You know, our customers today are finding tremendous value in how they're training their workforce. So, you know, it's, it's a perfect fit of the two, you know, portfolios together. That's great. What's changing about the platform and solutions to help customers gain value from their PTC product investments, Lori? I, I think what's changed, and, and part of that has come just with um, the evolution of the technology, is when we think about ThingWorks, we really looked at it initially just as a platform and provided it to customers and said, you know, you know, let's build our solutions. And now when we look at really focused use cases and we look at really transitioning to solutions, so we came out last year, just a year ago, with our DPM or digital performance management solutions that is really out of the box. So it lets customers get time to value much quicker. And, be, and, and it's really a closed loop system that really identifies and looks at what are the bottlenecks in my factory? How can I be more efficient? How can I see that data in a clear and easy way so I can actually you know, do something about it or make it actionable? And we didn't really have that sort of pre-configured pre solution for our customers, so they couldn't get the value fast enough. So I think that's been our biggest shift is really looking at it not just as a platform, but really bringing solutions to bear. And we do a lot with Rockwell as they build solutions on top of ThingWorks. Adam, any thoughts from you on that side? No, exactly that. I think um, as we're trying to identify industry needs and what we're trying to get to our customers faster, having the platform idea was great, but moving to that solution and outcomes that we really want to deliver to our customers faster to show that their investments are monetizing quicker. Um, PTC has invested heavily in that. Rockwell has given feedback and support to drive those outcomes uh, and those details in the product roadmap uh, along as we do our own. Lori, question for you. Rockwell is making investments in cloud and software as a service solutions to help add to customer value. What new is coming from PTC to make your products cloud ready? Absolutely. So we came out with, um, you know, we've been very focused on providing SaaS solutions to our customers. That's what the market wants. That's what our customer want, customers want. Um, with our PLM platform, our solution, Winchill or Winchill Plus, we've moved to a SaaS environment and we'll continue to do that with our products like ThingWorks. Euphoria is already in a SaaS uh, solution because it really makes sense for our customers when they look at it in terms of, again, Again, scalability and cost over time. That's really the model that we're, we're looking at. That's what the customers are looking for. And what you'll see as we continue to move on our journey.
All right, fantastic. When we think about out of the box and specific solutions for customers, how are Rockwell and PTC working together to address the changing needs of specific industries and customer segments, Lori? Um, I think Adam, you wanted to take that, but I can tell you, you know, we love to leverage their expertise in certain industries. They're very industry focused, uh, especially in life sciences. But you know, Adam's Mr. Expert on this. <laughs> well, Rockwell has a, a deep knowledge in industry. We go to market by industry. We serve a lot of different industries and process discrete across the board from a manufacturing standpoint. Um, what we're doing today is really leveraging that knowledge and taking PTC's technologies and looking at new ways to build use cases specific to industry. So we're augmenting the value of the platform, the solutions, but really meeting the needs of our customers today. So taking it one step further and saying what is out of the box, but what is out of the box for that customer and catering it to how we build our solutions. And we've used ThingWorks as a platform to build things that are specific to Rockwell's needs. And we'll be going to market together, really trying to drive the value of those Rockwell-esque uh, ideas that PTC typically wouldn't have brought because they're more focused on the platform and kind of general solutions for the market. Thanks for that, Adam. One last question, and that's about What's the most exciting thing? What excites you most about the PTC offerings that will be made available through Rockwell to their customers? You know, I think that as we continue to learn and understand the, understand those industries, so if we look at the OEM market, we look at some of the, the solution areas that Adam talked about, we are constantly evolving and taking the you know, expertise that Rockwell brings with their cu deep customer knowledge and continuing to evolve our solutions. And so when I think about our DPM solution, I think about how we're going to build on that and continue to innovate and the feedback we're getting from customers and the realizations that they're getting ahead of even what they predicted from the solutions is what really, really excites me. And I know that we'll continue to innovate and leverage Rockwell for their expertise that they bring really in the factory because that, you know, that's where they're known. It's fantastic. Lori, Adam, thank you so much for joining us in the studio today. Uh, the collaboration between Rockwell and PTC is such an exciting thing, and it's great to see it grow. Uh, so thank you for joining us. Thank you. Thanks. And if you'd like to learn more about Rockwell Automation and PTC solutions, make sure to visit rockwellautomation.com for more information.